Mickey's right now. You're at fixed gear. How you doing, dude? Blue screen. What's that, dude? Is the stream not up? Hello? Anybody there? <laughs> I was going to say, from my end, everything looks like I've got a connection to Twitch and everything looks all hunky-dory to me. Ah, I wonder if they gave us transcode. Anyone able to confirm if we've got transcode? Hello, Sky. How you doing? We've been really, really quiet, Sky. We, to give you an idea of where we are, we've just um, we left Fort Bob this morning and got killed by a dog with all our cement. And we managed to retrieve the corpse, well, the backpack. Uh, we went down to our new concrete build. We've done a little bit of work over there. And I've decided to spend the evening um, at that little house that we passed, which is probably about a quarter of the way from the new concrete build heading towards Fort Bob. And we got in here, and guess what's in it? A forge, mate. The only downside is it is downstairs, and it's right up against the wall on the bottom floor, so... But I'm just being very quiet. I'm literally not even moving. I've got no lights on. We're just sitting there, seeing if we can get through the night without any damage to the building. We have transcode. Oh, excellent. Thank you very much. Twitch. You guys and gals rock. Let me just uh, tweet out. Yeah, it's early to get a transcode, wasn't it, Fortune? That's awesome. What's that? Is I can I raid? Can I raid Twitch.tv Scafo two two two? He will probably be playing Seven Days to Die today at seven p.m. So will I, mate. <laughs> and also, <laughs> I swear we we kind of don't really do raids at the minute, mate. Because I always feel like if I do a raid one day. Well, one, we probably don't ever get the view numbers to call it a raid, but I always feel guilty about, like, who I choose. You know, there's a lot of really cool streamers that come into this channel, you know, some really small variety streamers, and I, I, I'd never know, but I think my golden rule is if I just don't do it, then I can't, I can't upset anyone. <laughs> it's not that I don't want to, I'd love to. If I was, like, a partnered channel and we could make one of those, like, little groups, that would be awesome. You know, like a, li a little network of, like, small streamers that you can go and have a look at, you know, who's doing what. But, you know, if the, if there's two or three of them on, I'd be like, oh, God. And it's not a case of we just do it in turns. It just, it's not as simple as that, is it? <laughs> All right, what time is it? It's ten past mid. Oh, should we do a spin? Oh, the Grum thing's up, by the way. Yeah, I've had a couple of people mention it. Like, you know, you should sort of like get a, get a network of like fellow sort of small variety streamers up. And it's it's just not a lot of point just having some random links, though, is there? It's it's, it's really nice with the partner channels because they can sort of create like a, a Twitch 
family, can't they, as I call them. And then you can go to that Twitch family page and you can see all the people in that family group who are currently streaming. And that's really cool. It makes it really easy then at the end of your stream, you can just say, right, everyone, thanks for watching. If you wouldn't mind supporting our other guests and streamers that watch this channel, off you go to that family, you know, that family window and you might have like three or four guys, gals all online at the same time. Some might be playing a game you hate, some might be playing a game you like. I'd, I'd never forgive myself, you know, I'd be like, how, how can you never like, you know, never host me or... I, I, <laughs> There's, it'd be alright if you only had one or two streamers that you liked. So. <laughs> it's probably, probably just best to stay away from it. <laughs> Hello, would you kindly? How you doing? Hello, Simpsy. Alright, let's get someone in the queue then. So first in is Fortune at 10.42. Officially noted, Fortune. Right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do, folks. I'm going to really quickly go and grab a coffee. And I, I hate having to leave you looking at nothing. But it's going better than it normally does of an evening. So I'm really reluctant to do so much as, like, tickle a bum hair right now. <laughs> right, I'll be back in about two minutes, then we'll do the draw, and hopefully it'll be six o'clock and we can get back to um, the concrete build. I'll leave it running. Um, if we die, we die. Let's Wow, still alive. Going strong. Right, let's do a spin then. Who we got in? We got, oh, hang on. Right, so we've got Sky, Kindly, Fortune, and Simpsy in. Would you kindly? Nice, that's your first spin, isn't it, mate? Good luck. 
that kindly. Let's get you that golden grumble, on, mate. We've currently got Fortune and Chica both with one for this month's draw. Oh, slow down, slow down. Fifty GBs. Thank you, Fortune. What game's that be, Zyke? Did you remove the update local files? Oh, you're talking about a reinstallation of this thing? Yeah, yeah. So one of the things I actually wanted to look at, I'm not going to... Hopefully this doesn't make noise doing this. What I wanted to have a look at was... The ramp... Oh, crap, what am I doing here? Hang on, my bad. Sorry, folks. Uh, what would it be called? It's rebar that I'm interested in. Is that just... Can I go to that for everything, or...? You can actually make... I never even noticed a little chair one there, look. It's like a sort of furniture. Rebar. Nothing there. What are these called, then? Rebar frames. Building. Rebar, no. Resources. Rebar. What the fuck? I did something like just stupid there, or I can't scroll anymore. I need to change that. You have to have the materials to do it. Hmm. Yeah, it's, it's a shame you can't have a look. It's a shame you can't have a look at rebar and it'll tell you, like, you know, you need the forge, but this is what you need. It's, it's a bit annoying. You can't check it anywhere, but... Oh, well, anyway, hey, hey. So, yeah, um, we'll have a little look in the forge when it's daylight. We'll go down. So we've only got a couple of hours to wait, so... I am playing with the Steam controller, yes, mate. Um, in fact, there's just one thing that I need to change. Um, unfortunately, the, the the weapon, or let's put it, the utility belt down here selects was mimicking a mouse scroll, which is fine normally, but in, in the heat of running away from a dog, you really want to know you can guarantee clicking on the bow and not go past it. Um, so I've changed it, but as a result of that, I've kind of lost my scroll option in this window. So I have to now use these. I mean, it's not a problem. It was kind of nice being able to just scroll, though. Kind of miss it. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's totally playable, mate. In, in fact, I'm a, I'm a big advocate for sort of controllers in any games. Um, and I tried playing this just with the Xbox Elite controller. Um, same with any any controller, whether it be the DualShock 4 or just standard Xbox 360 pad on the PC. Uh, it, it's not it's not viable, mate. Um, you you just cannot guarantee even remotely getting a headshot without a lot of jittery tweaking. Um, and in the heat of a really busy fight, that's just not going to happen, mate. This I would go so far as to say. I can see myself with some changes in sensitivity and, and how it operates um, mimicking mouse or trackball. I reckon I, I will get to a point where I'm just as good at with the Steam controller as I would be with a mouse in terms of just getting those headshots in. It's still never going to be quite as good as a mouse, I don't think. Um... But then again, the fact that everything is just there, you know, you're not, you're not going to have one hand on a keyboard, one hand on a mouse. It, it's, it's really nice, mate. Come on, come on, come on. It's nearly dawn. Just going to have a little look. I'm not pushing my luck. <laughs> Let's have a little look at the... Uh... Never known it's so quiet of a night, guys. 
This is beautiful. Concrete's drying, look. Can I actually use this or oh, no. Ooh, that sounded noisy. Right, rebar. It's actually these that I want to make. Okay. Well, they can wait till tomorrow, can't they? Let's leave it until flipping six o'clock. <laughs> you actually need to make a way out, obviously. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking the best bet there is using this existing door just here. It is locked, though. Should we give it a smack? God, that sounds really loud. Oh, it's actually just steps here, look. Oh, well, that's interesting. Oh, cool. Bit, bit of a weak point. <laughs> that's excellent. Now, what I was thinking of doing, and I suppose we could try it now, couldn't we? Oh, blonde, what's going on there? Uh, concrete mix. No? Oh no, sorry, cement. I always get this wrong, don't I? Cement. Let's favourite that. So all we need is stone. So let's put all the stone we've got. I know what you were saying about this fortune was that... Um, I run the risk of going too far and losing it all, don't I? So what about if we test it? Let's turn that on. And let's fucking leg it out of there. And let's see if it's if it's even here when we get back. I just don't know. Who knows? Let's get this stone. Yeah, I mean, that's it. So, like, I mean, they will have to... I mean, they will have to. It's as simple as that. They will literally... There will be no option. The game will be unplayable unless they bring in some sort of auto-aim. Um, which is what every other console game uses. So, you know, n not a problem with that. Um, and you'll be able to pop your headshots off quite nicely. You know, do something like where they do the general lock-on. And then it's like just gentle flicks just to get, you know, to, to hone in on the head. Loads of games have done it. Auto aim on a console is in just about every game. Loads of people deny it's there. I can tell you for a fact it fucking is there. And yeah, they'll be great. But, you know, I, I always said that I didn't fancy the Steam controller. I was always like, you know, I, I just I just don't... It just didn't feel right. You know, it looked cheap. It just didn't, you know, are they just making something different for the sake of making something different? My honest opinion, having used it for this game now for a few days, is that it's absolutely fantastic. But, and I need to make it really clear, um, it's never going to replace a dual analogue for games that are built to support dual analogue. So, for example, if I was to pick up Far Cry Primal, I would still use my Xbox Elite controller on PC. The games are built for dual analogue. They have that gentle um, aim assist um, and they just play fantastically. But for a game like this that has only got very basic, at this point, controller support, you, you literally, yeah, you can move and you can jump and you can navigate the world and you can do some basic things. But you still need a mouse to use your inventory or to aim with any hope of hitting anything. So you, for me, 
it's the best of both worlds, you know? I've got both controllers, and there will be some games... Are we going the right way? There will be some games that are better suited to the Steam controller, and there will be some games that are better suited to the uh, um, of this world. Uh, you're enjoying The Division? Really? Are you? Well, that's good. I'm glad you're enjoying it. It's a good game. Let's get making some concrete mix. And the other, the other thing that I, I have to say, um, I didn't, you know, it's very hard to envision or, or really understand what what haptic feedback really means. Um, on, on any device, I mean, you know, you know essentially what it's all about. But it's, uh, you know, each device kind of mimics in a different way or, or implements in a slightly different way. The haptic feedback on the Steam controller is fucking awesome. It really is fucking awesome. I love it. It's going to be really weird going back to um, the Xbox um, sort of elite controller. Oh shit! Look at my shitty look. There's a goddamn bear right in my. Oh my giddy aunt. That is just such an insane amount of bollocks. Oh, please bugger off. I'm always tempted to go and put campfire over there and see if he uh, goes and sniffs it out. So I can't do my rebar today. Um, so all I can really do here is build a little bit more of this. The most important thing is to get rid of all the cement each day, so I'm not, I'm not trying to take it back to camp. Because then, then if I die, we lose a whole day. So let's get as much of this built as we can. So we're essentially going four high, aren't we? I suppose what it would make sense just to shove that there, wouldn't it? Where's that bloody bear? What do you think, Simpsy? How's it looking, mate? Uh, what's that? So is this a new base, or are you just exploring? No, th this is the new base. Yeah, this is the new concrete base. This is the Big Daddy Grunt bunker. Well, all right, not not quite a bunker. Grum's Grum's ignoring me again. What have I done there, mate? You're right, Mixil. Bagietta invites you to be friends. I will I will accept your request after the stream. Thank you very much. New friends, look. <laughs> are, you, are you buying the drinks later tonight then? Yeah. Nice one, mate. Cheers, Bizite. Was that you, was it? Yeah, I always accept all the uh, invites at the end of the stream, mate. Right, so we're out of cement mix, um, concrete mix. So I need, so we're actually out of cement. So that's a good thing. That's, that's a good thing. Um, so what we need to, basically what we need is we need a, 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 a stone. What do we need to take back? We need to take stone and wood, don't we? We've got wood. So look, literally the rest of today, I mean, that's really cool. All I need to worry about now, I'm really quite tempted to make another bridge here. But... Three pounds donation received from SKYDS5811. Oh, wow. Great stream as always, Grum. Beware the zombies. Reinforce the fort. Listen to chat. A slow beware people in chat. Grum the gremlin shall steal your batteries. I <laughs> love it, mate. <laughs> Sky, thank you very, very much. I really appreciate that, mate. As we always say, not at all required, but very much appreciated. Thank you. 
Hey! We got a pop up there. Uh. We might please someone. I will give um, 30 grum bombs. A bit of time to kill today, so that's kind of good. We might try and take a little bit of food back. I think the only thing that really worries me right now um, is one me making a silly mistake, um, which, which I can't really help, but um, we are up. That that counted, did it? Oh God, what's going on there? There we go. Uh, we might please someone. I will give um, thirty grum bombs to whoever it is determined reminds me officially to make um, some sort of uh, some sort of improved skinning knife. I, I must be able to make something out of metal that will be better. Than this bone thing. What's that Simpson? You meant the house I was in overnight? Oh no, 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 no. That was just um I left it a little bit late to head back, Simpsy, and I hadn't used all my cement that day. Um so I decided to, to try and um rest up to, so I didn't have to risk going back through the dog axe near Fort Bob. Um, so that that was just a little uh, a little stop by really. I'm just gonna put all the feed in there. Yeah, I, I will do some. So yeah, remind me when we get back, mate. Be much appreciated because I will forget, as you know. Um, right. So really, the most important thing today is stone because we need that to make the cement this evening. It's all going all right, mate. It's all going all right. I feel, I feel calm. I feel like I've got a plan at the minute. And I think because we're not, you know, co you know, doing lots and lots of building all in one go, we're sort of spreading that heat map around a little bit, aren't we? I mean, whether or not that's really what's happening, I don't know. But I think I chose a good location for rocks, trees, and just general um, sort of wildlife as a food source. So each evening we can get... I mean, what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to put a campfire over this side of the river. I'm going to make another bridge over here. I'm going to put a campfire just here and cook up some of the food. And hopefully, you know, even if something gets attracted to it, um, it won't be anything too major. So I can't make a skinny knife, what, even with all the rebar stuff? Not even, like, some basic... It seems silly that I can make a pickaxe, but I can't make, um... Like a basic blade. I mean, can I buy it as a skill? I mean, surely, I mean, we've got that many skill points we're going to spend tonight. I suppose we keep talking about tonight. It all depends on whether or not we can actually get back into Fort Bob, to be honest, folks. You, have you been uh, playing anything, Simpsy? Eh? Keep meaning to ask you, mate. Yeah, I've got I've got a little plan for that fortune. I've got a little plan. I think you're gonna like my base, my base concept, and it'll be reproducible. Um, what we're gonna use? We're gonna see how long it takes me to knock this up, and you know it's gonna take me a while because we're still learning a little bit. And obviously, it's a long run back to Fort Bob. I mean, I really need to leave out for Fort Bob. To be honest, about five o'clock. Um. I'm seriously thinking I will probably leave about four o'clock today, pop into that house and just see if that forge has actually been battered in any way. If it hasn't, I, I'm going to slowly start moving out of Fort Bob, mate. See, the plan is, is this, um, this base here is going to have a forge in it, but quite high up in like a tower. Um, and I'm going to use that as my, you know, we're going to travel about two hours each day out and start setting up another camp. Doesn't need to be quite as exotic as this one. This is my first, if you like, base that I like to think can survive a pretty hefty horde attack. We shall see. They're not playing anything at all, uh, Simps, you know. 
Yeah, we've switched to experimental VD. Yes, we have. We did it um just before we started today. So honestly don't know, mate. Is it we've had one quiet night, but we did last time. Sometimes that bug doesn't hit. Um until a little bit later on, sometimes if you you know if you spawn in and then leave the area, let's put it this way: when we were at Fort Bob, mate, there was a lot of fucking zombies there, dude. Oh yeah, of course it's at the top right, isn't it? Yeah, fourteen point six. Um, I'm playing on a on single player, Kempy. It's a bit more of a challenge, to be honest, mate. In fact, to be honest, it's a ridiculous challenge on your own, but I'm enjoying it immensely. What about you then, dude? You want a server, are you? I think we're just going to meerkat around here. See, I, I could never play this game PvP, Emper. But I just couldn't do it, mate. It's bad enough as it is, um, you know, dying to an unlucky attack by a, by a hound or, you know, just slipping up and having a zombie creep up on you. And just knowing that there's other players out there that are, are hacking, glitching, cheating, or even playing, you know, reasonably safely. And they see you, you know, out here busy chipping away. They come along and kill you, and they take, you know, something like your cement production. I, it just drives me mad, mate. I just couldn't do it, dude. It would, it would be in no way whatsoever even remotely enjoyable for me. And I'm not the sort of person that likes to play on the other team. Do you know what I mean? I'm not the sort of person that would go around. If I saw someone here doing exactly what I'm doing from a distance, right, I'd leave them alone or maybe even go up to them and have a chat with them. That's what I'd like about a server, you know, that wasn't privately run. But I think 90% of people would see me doing this and would basically come and put an arrow in the back of my head just because they can. It says a lot about um, people, I think. <laughs> yes, we are, Simpson. We're on a 14.6 experimental build. I wonder how much stone we've actually got. Have a quick look. Oh, we said we said we wanted to take a thousand stone back. I think we've done it. Yeah, what fortune said Simpson, you just um opt into the beta and choose the experimental build. Uh, well, it didn't when we logged in, Simpson, but it might be one of those things that maybe takes a little bit of time. You know, the the, the already spawned in horde maybe has to dissipate. I, I don't know. I, I honestly just don't know, mate. But Right, so we're going to leave the food that we've got here. We're going to head back now. We're going to have a look at... We've got plenty of time to go back. Have a check at the um, the forge in the house. We've already killed a couple of deer, so when we come back tomorrow, we can cook that up. We've already got the water in the bottles with the murky, murky water, haven't we? So... I'm guessing this is the house here, right? Uh, 
Let's just say forge. Right, let's go. I'm going to drink my coffee, folks. One sec. And the experimental version was only released about six hours or so ago, mate. Now, put me coffee down to do this. Look, where's that bloody bird's nest gone? I have my coffee very strong um, with a little bit of cream if I can, mate. A little bit of fresh cream. And no bloody sugar. Looks like it's uh, not attracted too much attention, you know. Can I turn that off? Once I've got the stone made, can I actually turn it off or does it not work like that? Welcome to all the stone we had. Oh, it's already in the Q203. Oh, I see how it works. Uh, I'm just going to leave that. See if, it, uh, see if it's still there tomorrow. Why not, eh? So we're heading towards um, Camp Bob then, yeah? God, I hope we can get in here tonight. See, my, my worry now is, Fortune, what you said about that despawning when we get like a certain distance away from it. So, I mean, I suppose the only way to do it is to test it, isn't it? Maybe I shouldn't have been quite so... Uh, um... Well, abundant with the amount of stone I put in it. <laughs> it's a 500 stone takes a while to gather. It's not going to break the bank or anything, but... It's like you were saying about that. Maybe it just doesn't... Uh... Good job of detecting bird's nests today, aren't I? I wonder how bad Fort Bob is looking. What we want to do is we want to be coming to Fort Bob now and not seeing a god... Well, obviously a zombie or three, but... Oh, fuck me! I'm starting to think I should have left that motherfucker well alone. Should we go around him? What the fuck? Oh my god, you scared the bejesus out of me then. Oh fuck, there's a cop there. Oh my... Oh god, and there, oh god, and there goes the dog look. Oh shit, monkeys. What the hell's just hit me? Oh fuck off, dude. This is ridiculous, mate. Still fucking coming, bro. Oh, fuck off. Are we gonna die? Oh, I don't believe it, mate. Oh, Jesus. Fuck, we're bleeding. We're going to die. Fuck this game, man. Oh, 
So I'm not playing it. Fuck it. I'm not playing it with these fucking dogs. These, they're just fucking retarded, man. It's, it's heartbreaking dying. So every fucking time I die, it's to a fucking dog. They're fucking, it's, it wouldn't be so bad if they, they weren't just fucking glitching out, bouncing around, being retarded little fucking shit nuggets, but no. God damn it, let's hope we can get our fucking gear back, man. It's just not even remotely fucking fun, that isn't. A second you see a dog, you're basically fucking dead. Unless you can get on completely flat, smooth terrain. Number of times you put an arrow straight through its fucking testicles and the thing just keeps running at you. And now it'll be there, roaming around my backpack, like little bastard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dearie me. I tell you what we should do, right? I should buy myself a bottle of Jack Daniels, and every time we get killed by a dog, yeah, I should like drink half a pint. <laughs> it'd, it'd make it all so much better then. <laughs> right, let's see if we can get our gear back. Um, see what I was saying about coming back at five o'clock? You just can't, you just can't afford for anything to go wrong. So well, we'll, we'll go up a bit slower. What would be really nice is, you know, um, I suppose it's all to do with resolutions, though, isn't it? Uh, it'd be nice to have, like, a little distance meter um, on whatever you're heading towards, if you know what I mean? And I know you can check the map and everything, but... Ooh, wrong button. God, I hate the dogs. I really, really hate the dogs. I just... I either, either make it so they don't... You know, that the hitbox is... The, the fucking hitbox, or, ju or just remove them. Why not? Wrong button. Right, we've got everything back, so we haven't actually lost anything. Right, see if we can get back in. Um, my bow's not looking. I swear to God, if that dog is behind me, I'm gonna fucking rage quit, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pack a, thank you, Super Steve. Pack a Harry Bows and a Duracell. Cheers, mate. You know how to cheer me up. Imagine, oh, seriously, though, honestly, if that happens, yeah, like that, and I lose like a day's production of cement, the uh, the chance of this steam controller surviving, because I'm going to be honest, it's not very well built. It does feel like a little bit of pressure applied to it could probably end quite badly. The Xbox Elite, I think you could probably uh, build houses out of those things. They're uh, they're rather well manufactured, but I don't, I don't think this thing would would take um, much more pressure than I just applied to it. Then <laughs> I hate coming back here. I hate it. Look at the state of it. Oh my God! Look at the damage they've done. It's a miracle it's still standing, isn't it? I mean, that's had basically a 24-hour horde. Oh, look. Oh, shit, my other entrance is gone. However, however, what is worthy of note is that there don't appear to be any fucking zombies here. So as long as I don't fall off and fucking break my own neck, which, by the way, has happened several times, just for those that are new to the stream. <laughs> right, thank the Lord for that. Uh, got any blocks? So we normally have two of these. That, that's, that's a good sign, guys. Home sweet. Bloody home. Right, let's have ourselves some... F well, we don't need any feet because we died, didn't we? <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's actually, you've, you've got a good point there. It could be worth seeing, being quiet tonight and seeing if we can do some basic repairs down there tomorrow morning. I, I think I like that idea. So uh, let's just put some bits away. Uh, I don't want that or that or that. Or, oh, we do want that because we're going to take that up to the forge, don't we? 
sort of want everything we've got on actually. That's been quite a good run. Um, let me take some of the. Oh, is that all we've got? Actually, that shouldn't be in there, should it? That's why. Uh, oh, what? I've got. What? I've got no golden rod flowers? Surely not. I bloody haven't, you know. Wow. Well, I'll tell you what I will do. I'm going to take um, a cooking pot back with me. Um, and we have got a spare grill, haven't we? So we'll take those back to... We'll make a little campfire. What's my... Feed's okay in a minute. So we're going to want to take those back. Let's get this puppy going. Um, you know what I'm not going to have? I'm not going to have enough bloody wood to get the furnace up and running. Let's uh, make some bottled water. And we'll come back and sort that out in a jiffy. Okay. Stone, 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 stone. Where's all my cement gone? Uh, I think we're out of range. I think you're right, Fortune. I think it's all despawned out of it. That's a bugger, isn't it? I think, anyway. I'm not sure, to be honest. Oh, no, there's the stone. 6,000 stone. Oh, wow. What? No way, dude. Oh, that is fucking phenomenal, guys. Now, I am very sorry about the noise, but obviously I also need to have a look at some rebar, don't I? Grum, someone is in queue. Uh-huh. Well, someone made it for an hour already. No way. Oh, Jesus. Hang on. What, what, what? Okay, 10.42, dude. 10.42, we started. It's not until 11.42. to the pimps, yes. Um, the fort's going okay, Zunin. Uh, what was I going to do? Uh, rebar, wasn't it? Um, I've got no clay. Do I have to put the iron and clay in here first? God, let's, let's close that because that's making a right old racket. Let's just leave that manufacturing my vast and copious quantities of uh, illegally manufactured cement. <laughs> oh, wow. We're actually making some fucking progress. Oh, I died. Oh, sorry. Yes, of course. Oh, my apologies. Yeah, 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 yeah. Does anyone know what time we died? I'll tell you what. Seeing as I didn't register it, I'm going to play by my own rules. So you've actually got, officially now, is when you died, all right? So you've actually got some brucey, cheeky, extra grum bombs there, Fortune. And we'll actually play it a little bit like that, because what I don't want is somebody to come straight into the queue and die straight away on the body pickup. So actually, that, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to slightly tweak the rules on the queues for this game. It seems very harsh for someone who dies and the next person in the queue knows straight away they've got to get a body back. So I'm going to make some judgment calls. So... You actually get uh, 18. Oh, hang on, no, you don't. Uh, well, the time on the clock, it was 10.42. Let's put the time on the clock as 11.24, all right? And the next person in the queue is about to come out. So kindly up with a clock start of 11.24. And we're just going to do a spin as well. Yeah, essentially an extra eight grum bombs, Simpsy. Uh, I think I think we keep it fair. We don't we don't poor bastards flying through the uh, <laughs> through through their, their grum bombs at a rate of knots. That oh, hang on, how come I can't make? Oh damn, all the wood's gone. Dang. Oh well. So for food tomorrow, we'll take that. 
and that. We're keeping a little bit of canned food on us just in case. And we keep the hat with us. Gather some more golden rod while we're out. And I definitely don't want all those feathers. Um, in fact, I think we'll put all of them in there. Now, if we're really lucky, I did actually have a load of wood. So what I'm thinking... Oh, look, sand there as well. Let's take that. We want that. Oh, Simpsy, Simpsy, don't let me forget the... Uh, whatever it's called. The, the uh, skinning knife thing. That's clay, cement and the rebar. Let's make ourselves some wooden... Well, I'll tell you what, let's, let's put a little bit of... Ooh. What the fuck just happened there? Whoa, dude, what the hell? Might as well cut those up. Um, and I think what I'll do is I'll make some wooden frames to see if we can uh, shore up. Uh, I mean, let's let's make say sixty frames. See if we can shore up underneath this tower a little bit. It's only the tower we really need to worry about, isn't it? And it is made out of like fucking concrete, I suppose. <laughs> Are you two having some trouble with maths there? <laughs> Hang on a minute, how many she got? <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'll tell you what we'll do. You're going to have to put up with the noise, I'm afraid, folks, because I do want to go and see if we actually can manufacture. Ooh. Oh, that's noisy, isn't it? What would it be under then? Tools. So, are we saying that I can't make that, no? Uh, can we make it under skills? Weapons? Not weapons, is it? Tools. Tool smithing. No? How, how do I make a, a metal skinning knife? Does anyone know? What would be of most benefit to me at the moment? Um, we're very much sort of manufacturing concrete, really. I mean, I don't need to worry about any scavenging stuff at the moment. What about the mining tools? No, maybe not. Minor 69er. Would be worth me getting another point in that. I think I'm going to put a point in that. There you go. Um, <sighs> hmm. Yeah, don't, don't worry. Once we've got the base set up, we're, we're going to use it, you know, we're really... We're, I mean, that's what the, the whole plan was, was to get a, a base built, get a forge in it, and then go exploring. Um, it's just that, obviously, with that perma horde running, we've just, we're so far behind where we should be. Uh, I'll just get this concrete base built. And I think we'll be good to go. Don't want that. Uh, get rid of that. Loads of, uh, loads of cement, aren't we? It's actually quite easy to make. Got 13 of these and 6 bottled water, so I think what I'll do is leave the bottled water. Oh, hang on, that's the wrong one, isn't it? Uh, 
Is the bottled water there? Yep, it's looking good. The iron and clay, what was I going to make? Some rebar, wasn't it? I mean, I've still got 205 frames. I just need to make some of the angled ones. And I'm, I'm not going to do anything tonight. I'm not going to risk it. No, 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 no. No, I want, I want this base built since I, I know what you're saying. I'm not putting it off for any reason other than the fact that I just want to get a base. But I want to prove to myself we can make this base, dude. Whoa, what the fuck? That was weird. That was weird. So we're going out with a thousand cement, so that'll be a hundred blocks because it's ten per, isn't it? It's one cement, two stone, one sand. God, that is loud. Um, can you not make corner, corner rebar fortune? Oh, in a corner. Maybe I can make that. What the hell's frame pillar? Oh, you can actually make pillar pillars. Oh, that's kind of cool. Sorry, folks. Very noisy, I know. So, I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's take the stone out. Um, so we make all the cement that we can. With what we've got left in there. Um, and then let's put some iron and get that smelting down. There we go. And we'll be making some rebar ramp. Um, probably about, probably about, I'm going to tell you what, let's make 40 if I can. i going to wait for the iron to keep going. Just come out of that. Oh, wow, that's loud. I mean, there's no way to do it. You can't vary um, different sounds, can you, I don't think, unless anyone can tell me how to do it. I think you just have, like, global, you know, music or just general, don't you? You love the noise, it helps you sleep at night. <laughs> what, are those, what are those things that uh, the musicians use? Um, is it a metronome or something? It, it, it's like a Hell's version of a metronome, isn't it? That, if that's the name of what I'm thinking of. You know, the little things that go tick, 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 tick. Oh, it's a bit slower than that, but... What's that? You no, but you can make debentures. What the hell's a debenture? It sounds like something. It sounds like a dodgy denture. You're that old that you wear dentures, fortune. You're a bit of a gummy bear when you sleep at night. <laughs> Let's have a look how this is going. Still, still got all my cement cube, look. Ah, oh, dang, you noisy. Um, what else was I going to do? Do what I will do. I'll have a drink. No, no, we'll do the spinning. It's, it's only two o'clock. Okay, what I'll do is I'll go and get a coffee and um, sort of do the spins. That, that pe people can then join the channel, you see. If we, if we start getting a bit more... Um, consistent so if ever, everyone will always know that we'll do we'll do a spin of an evening so what we'll do is we'll draw it around the f anywhere after four o'clock each evening people will know they've got plenty of time to jump in and grab a ticket then won't they We've got plans for it, genius you're getting all fucking all I, I, I fucking picked up notepads this morning mate 
<laughs> right, I'm going to stay there. Oh, we've not said hello to Bob, have we? We're ever so sorry, Bob. How were you last night, mate? Yeah, we stayed out last night, dude. We had a, we had a wild time. What about you? Really? Ladies? Oh, nice. Tell me about it later, mate, yeah? Back in a minute. Right, I'm going to leave you there. I'm going to go and grab a coffee, because I, I drank like about three sips of my last one. Did I just hear a zombie then? Fuck off, zombie. <laughs> Grum gummy grey beard. <laughs> Be toothful. <laughs> yeah, I, I smashed out a tooth. Uh, how long ago is that now? Oh, it's, you know, those stitches. Oh, mate, when they came out, they, they just simply fell out. I swallowed one. It was disgusting. Well, a bit of one. A bit of a knot, I think it was. <laughs> Let's cheer this up. Fuck you. Fucking mods. <laughs> All right, I'll be back in about two, three minutes, folks. And there is um, a raffle on for us. See that, Doc? Evasive manoeuvres, mate. Any other pilot, dead. That's what you do in those so you stay calm. What don't the panic. hell? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> I've got to go back towards the fucking... Who's up at the minute, now? by the way? Fuck me, this is a disaster. I know I'm taking heat damage. You don't need to keep telling me about the heat damage. Oh, Kindly. Just, wow, okay. Everyone calm their knickers, all right? <laughs> Yeah, I keep doing that, don't I, Simpson? You yeah, have to remember about that. It's about about a second or so. There's a couple of things I can do about, about that. I've just not had a chance to look into it, to be honest. Um, what was I going to do then? What was I going to say? Uh, spin time, four o'clock. Look, let's get, let's do that, and then we uh, can crack on, can't we? <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't know, Campy. There's there's different sorts of cream, mate. Uh, it's not the stuff that you spray out of a fucking can. Put it that way, mate. Pro proper cream. <laughs> Sky again. Nice one, Sky. GZ, GZ.
Good luck, Sky. Oh, keep going. Come on. Oh, no. God damn, son. Thanks for watching. Right, so let us go and have a look. See up top. Let's see if um, we want to get those rebars made, don't we? Let's put a light on so we can see what the hell we're doing. Whoa! Looks like there's something there that just stops me uh, getting up smoothly. Um, Rebar frames. We definitely want around 40 of those. Well, actually, we want a lot more than that, but that'll do for now. Looking good, isn't it? It is actually looking pretty bloody good. Um... You know what it might be worth us doing? Just sticks. We've got an hour, haven't we? Uh, where's all. Oh, wow. Look at all this in here. I didn't even see that. Wrong button, dude. I was going to say, wow. Um, how do I repair something? Oh, repair. How do I repair this then? You actually have to have it in your inventory, maybe? No. Oh, okay. That seems a bit shit. Can I not make like a fire axe as well? I'm, I'm kind of a bit confused uh, as to what I can and can't make right now. Does all of this come from... Is this why the library is so important as such? Because I was pretty sure... Pickaxe, not even there. Axe. What the fuck? Wrong menu, right? No? Oh, confused as fuck, mate. Pickaxe. Why is nothing coming up? Yeah, we, we've made one before, mate. How do I, how do I make a steel pickaxe? I thought it was in here. Ammo weapons, resources building. Am I the wrong fucking thing again? Axe in regular crafting. Oh, it's a regular crafting. Ah, right, okay. Uh, Ah, look, I can make a steel fire axe. I'm getting hot. Oh, dude, look. Oh, mate, I still fucking shovel as well. Bucket, barb ooh, barbed wire. That sounds cool. Is that any good? Hmm. God damn it, we need to get going. Come on. How long's that lock gonna take? Oh. Oh, that, oh, that's with me. Uh, we could actually go, couldn't we? Everything I need. I think we have. Should we just go? Let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go. Let's do this. Should we shut the door? I'd actually be better off trying to repair downstairs when we get back later today rather than now, but I'll be so careful there. Oh my giddy aunt, mate. There's nothing fucking left. You reckon they're the two... Oh my god. I reckon they're the two pillars <gasps> that are essentially holding up my entire... 
Oh my fucking god, bro. This is not fucking good, you know. This is a lot worse than I thought. Wow, bro. around there just shit mate can I get rid of that oh, fuck wow they have rocked the shit out of this haven't they um what about just shoving a few oh bollocks you can't do it because of these oh fuck that was a bit unlucky wasn't it you watch me hit this now, right? This, this will, the whole lot will come down as I knock his freaking grill out. You watch it. <laughs> Go on. Well, I feel a little bit safer now we've done this. I mean, it might not be a lot, but it's a little bit of something, isn't it? Golden rod while we're out. Yeah, cheers, Simpson. Just throw a few more supports in. I mean, it's... Jesus, mate. Um, you've got to think that's sort of where we are, haven't you? Um... So quiet, isn't it? It's it's really weird. I'm not. I, I feel, <laughs> it's amazing. It's just so much more enjoyable. <laughs> oh god, dang man. Um, and that, that that's definitely going to make a bit of a difference. Um, I'm thinking about putting another pillar up there. So what I might do do that. Uh, needs a fair bit of wood, but Roof can go eight across before needing a support pillar. Isn't it? Doesn't it depend on the material? Though? Don't different um, blocks have different structural integrities? Because, like, like for example, dirt, you can only put like one block out or something, yeah. Or is that is that not what you mean? Oh, Simpsy, honestly, mate, this this feels more like it, you know. It means the hordes are actually going to be hordes now, you know, on on the seventh day, as opposed to. Uh, just like this constant freaking train wreck. We're we actually going to be able to get. Now, I'm not saying it's going to make a massive difference, but I think we might have just shored up Fort Bob long enough for it not to collapse in the next week. When's next Horde Day? But day 35, I and mean, it's not that far away, actually, is it? I know, Zunin. I mean, if I could have um, done a little bit of this each day, I mean, oh, God damn it, I didn't mean to do that. And that, that's looking, you know, we've got three pillars with full supports at the bottom there, haven't we? So I think if I maybe just put another couple of blocks here. I mean, that's, that's a lot better, mate. I mean, whether or not the edge collapses, it's probably not quite so important. I mean, little things like this, I suppose, look. Tell you what would be really nice, you see in the bottom right hand corner <laughs> where it tells you what materials you're using. It would would have been really, really nice if it actually told you um Oh 
shit. Uh, for example, how many you'd got left. So then minus 10 wood, and then like a little slash out of 300, and then minus 10 slash 290, minus 10 slash 280, you know? Oh, hang on. We need to... Fucking hell, it's like a freaking ghost town, isn't it? Uh, so we want to go here. Quick waypoint. Go. And it's only 9 o'clock. I mean, we spent three hours shoring up. Probably, oh, fuck, dog. We'll probably spend tonight, um... Oh, that definitely sounds like a dog. Jesus. It... <laughs> I tell you what, we've done well. We have done really well to even get this far. <laughs> and now, hopefully, we can start making some breaks with the game. Might even get wellness up to 75 at some point this week. Ah, that's pushing a bit much, isn't it? Whoa. Running, running away with me, bro. I just want to see if the forge has uh, actually continued working. Because that means if it is, I mean, that'd be great. That means we've got two forges quite nicely separated. Um... What? Oh, she's dead, isn't she? Is she? Yeah. Damn, that freaks me out when they do that. Uh, oh, I've not got no wood. Ah, oh, shit. Um, thank you very much for the follow, Kenny Fidan. Oh, shit. Look at this stuff that I brought. Oh, I should not have brought this stuff, guys. Oh, god dang. That was a mistake. Um... Oh, that was a mistake. Thank you very much, Johnny Farmer. Cheers, bro. Right, let's go get building. Fuck me. This is insane. So where's my... Oh, God. Oh, yeah, there's the bridge lock. So, um... Set a quick waypoint and let's get going. Yeah, we'll, we'll stay in the house tonight. I'm not going to go back to the other forge. Um... Oh, I'm quite excited. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah, sandwich looks delish. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll save that later, Zunin. Hey, well, what's that? Is that a drop? Is that an airdrop? Oh, my God. We're getting all the luck today. Dead or not? Just make fucking sure. Fucking God, dude. A rocket launcher. Fuck off. <laughs> Can I not drink that? Must be full. We need we need these. Tell you what we will do. We'll get rid of that. Uh tell you what. Uh what can I get rid of? Cobblestone France, don't want them, do we? Fucking God, fucking shit balls, mate. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> oh, wow. 
This is great, mate. Level 40 fucking 7 with Infinity Horde as well. Come on, Grub. Don't fuck this up, mate. Someone please, please remind me. No matter what happens, right, at 3 o'clock, I need to go out. I'll only be about an hour, hour and a half, maybe. But if I don't go at 3, it means it's going to be really hard for me to then get back later tonight. So... We seem to be getting hot, don't we? Can't take that off because I've got. Let's go and get this campfire set up. Oh look, the looming concrete bunker. See what I'll do. I'm just going to put this stuff in here just for now and, and hope to God it doesn't get smashed. But uh, it shouldn't do, should it? Um, put that in. Everything else is coming back with me. Okay. What do I need? I'm at a small stone, but. Well, let's do a meerkat. Nice. It's quite cool today. Oh, no way, bro! It's, it's like fucking Christmas, dude. Um, try and get perfectly lined up with that. I reckon. Let's put a marker. Nah, fuck it. Ah, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. We, we burn it. We, once we've got the base set up, that's the sort of shit we can get have fun with. How the fuck does this work? Oh it, oh, it remembers it. Oh, that's great. I didn't know it did that, actually. Sweet, mate. Oh, hang on. Oh. I... Do I... Oh. So I still need to stay an axe, right? Tools, 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 tools. Favourites. Stone axe. Fuck. Ah! I need stone and wood. Oh, bollocks, mate. That's This is a disaster. I, I didn't realise I still needed the stone axe. I was replacing it with this bloody thing, and of course this this does not build things, does it? Shit. All right, let's get a tree down. Wow. Oh my god, look how fast that takes a tree down. Good god, sir. That's amazing. What's the matter with the green sammies? We want the green sammies. We can we can make things. We we <laughs> we, we can make play dough out of those. Uh, craft. Can't believe I still need this piece of shit. So what what's the replacement for this? Is that the wrench or the nail gun? Am, 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 am I remembering that correctly, or am I completely off track with that? That is actually full, right? Can I, can I do this while it's still wet? It's not going to, like, start dripping out or anything, right? <laughs> hey, what do you reckon about this, then, eh? 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 So I need a corner piece. Um, did we actually ever make a corner piece? I don't think we did, did we? No, we'll make some of them later. I mean, will a spider zombie get up in those corners? Nail gun to upgrade. All right. All clear. All 
I'm in the fucking zone today, Simpson. I'm telling you, mate. Right, now the plan is... We're going to have a double row. For rage incoming if you don't um, toss those green sammies, you hobbit muggle. Fuck you. I'm fucking keeping my green sammies. What you got against my green sammies, you bugger? <laughs> uh, what I'm going to do, actually, I'm just going to pretend momentarily, okay? So they are going to be spikes, and they're going to be spikes. In fact, I'm going to have a triple row of spikes, because then what I'm going to do, we're going to have, this is like, this is called the Grum Wheelie Ramp. They can't get over two, can they, right? Or can they? Is that the same height? No, I'm going to need one higher, aren't I? Okay. Oh, shit, did I do it central? Yeah, I was going to go for a triple, a triple run-up. Oh, no, because the top... Oh, no, 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 because the top one's going to be a ramp. Uh, I don't actually want that one, do I? Uh, I don't want that one either. Fuck. I do want... Well, hang on. Yeah, we'll play. Uh... Yeah, that'll work, I think. It's hard to make out where that is. There you go. Well, I put the wrong sort in there. That's a ramp one in there, isn't it? But I didn't mean that. Door. Oh. You get to the top and then you jump over there. Now, can you make that? Oh! Oh, dude. It's fucking gorgeous. It's fucking gorgeous, mate. I'm pretty sure I've put... No, no, I haven't. It won't let me... Get out. Yeah. It's a ramp. Yeah, it's a ramp, Simpson. Gonna be, it's going to be three wide, so even I can get in it, yeah? Because, like, you know, I'm not I'm not particularly good at my aim. So I'm going to have it three wide. Uh, take care, Campy. Thanks for joining us, mate. Nice to see you, bro. Look after yourself. Have a nice weekend if I don't see you. And thank you for the follow as well, mate. What, you see, you see where I'm going with this, Simpson. Fortune, stamp of approval. And then essentially these here obviously won't be here. These will be spikes. So even if the zombies come up here, so pretty, and this is going to be flat. So as long as I come up at a reasonable, I suppose the only can you oh. Jumping off might be a bit harder, but oh no no oh I've got a... oh I tell you I've got a cracking idea. You're gonna love the idea. I'll show you later. What the fuck's the matter with him? What the fuck's the matter with him? What's the matter with you, bro? What are you moaning, dude? Is he thirsty? Hungry? What's the matter with him? Food's okay. Water's okay. Just hot, yeah. You get a bit warm, dude. Let's take your top off. There you go, bro. Grum, check the temperature. You're too hot or too cold. Done it. You silly sausage. Done it. 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 I'm in the zone, mate. I'm in the zone. Tell you. It will be a beautiful. And oh, you're gonna see what's. Uh, oh, you're gonna be so proud, Simpson. I'm, I'm telling you, you're gonna be so proud. <laughs> <laughs> 